hello bitches welcome back to my channel hmm. this is not sweet at all but i have to share with you guys for you guys just you know be careful people that involved and this time around it's not even only asylum seekers i think most people that are involved in all those things these things they are doing so today being 25th of september 2024 germany will be deporting people from frankfurt to gambia hmm. today yeah Secondly, from 15th of October 2024, Germany will be deporting people from Frankfurt Airport to Lagos, Nigeria Airport. Lastly, for now, we don't know. On 12th November 2024, Germany will be deporting people from Frankfurt Airport to Nigeria, Lagos, then to Ghana. You know what is happening? Please, asylum seekers, if you know they rejected you, don't look at money. Look for a lawyer. Not even just looking for a lawyer. Look for a good lawyer that is ready and honest to fight for you and your children. Don't look at that money and gonna waste just to do it. And so that so that they will fight for you. Not any hard lawyers. A lawyer that is honest and ready to fight for you and, and your family. Secondly, if I have not been in this country for five years and you don't have kids, I have not worked in this country, you cannot file for this orphan tax allowance. You can't file, you can't file for it because you are not qualified to you know file for it. That, that's why I used to tell people if you are in this country, even if you have worked for some months or just you know try to just work try to integrate yourself you know there's something that is happening even now that i don't really know what germany is up to i heard somebody was saying that they picked them from where they are working these people they are way integrated in this country they are way integrated they still went to the, where their working place pick them now german says they are looking for skilled workers they are trying to reach an agreement with some countries to bring their skilled workers here and people are still working there and they are still deporting them so is this in confusion from anywhere or maybe the people that are doing it they are not doing what they ask them to do i can't see why they say they are looking for skilled workers and they are still deporting people that are way integrated these people i'm telling you now is people that they are way integrated they are working they will just go to their working place and just pick them and put them in the position section and after everything they will deport them Sometimes, I don't know why they are separating families. Some families are being separated because of all these things that is happening now. They will deport mother, they bought father, they bought maybe two children and leave one. Probably they will, the one will be in school or something like that. Then they will just hand that one over to the country. What are they trying to do? That's what I'm asking. What are they trying to do? What are they trying to do? I heard that they asked them to bring some of them they deported because they didn't check very well. Because these people, they have, you know, they were integrated. They speak the language they are working. You just went to the office and just, you know, this is just costing a lot of money for tax and everything. After deporting them, they will still go and bring them back. Is They are just wasting a lot of money. I don't really know what is happening. Separating homes. You said you need a skilled workers and people are working. You are still going to this, going to the where they are working place, picking them. Some of them, they'll go to where they are doing hospital and pick them. Hospital mm. means where they are learning handwork. They will still go and pick them and drop them where they are doing deportation. Deportation section and after everything, they will deport them. Some of them, they will go to school. People that are going to language school, they will just go to school and pick them and still deport them. Now I'm asking, what is the problem? Looking for skilled workers and people are here working and they are still deporting them. Why? I ask people, just, you know, anytime you just go out of your house, just pray and commit everything to the hands of God. It's only God that can be able to protect us in this country, honestly. Because people are way integrated, they are still deporting them. I'm not even talking about asylum seekers. Do you know what German are doing now? They said, even if you say you are you know, homo or something like that, or more homo, they, you know, they don't even care about it. 
they will just take that person to the country. Do you know before, if you just, you know, say you are a homo or something like that, or modi, or modi, you know, they will just keep you in the country but now they don't care even if you say you are homo that is your business they will see the border person meaning they should you know that person should go and face it because they know some country doesn't accept such things like nigeria doesn't accept such things so if they if you say you are or it has been in your in your fight that that's what they will just deport the person doesn't even care they don't care Strictly speaking i will tell people now germany is not a place for you to come and seek asylum Mm -mm. it's not working right now for now it's not working in germany for you to come and seek asylum just look for another country people that said i just want to enter germany now people that you know, are pregnant you just want to enter germany it's not working anymore people that are here that are even living for the crazy the people are here they have not finished taking them they are still deporting them and i have not seen any asylum they are taking right now as far as you are not from that war country, we are there doing war. Germany will never accept you. Even if you are still in asylum, they are waiting for them to decide your case. I will tell you to look for another place to go because they might not accept. That was the truth. They are not accepting now. So I just want to bring it for you people to know what is just going on and know what to do. I hope this thing will help one or two people. Please just, you know, don't look at money as I said. If they, re if they have rejected you and everything, just look for a lawyer. And a lawyer that is ready and strong, that is ready. See what I said, that is ready because there are some lawyers, they are not doing anything. You will look for a lawyer that is ready, that people know this particular lawyer for this particular thing, asylum case. They look for that lawyer and pay them, let them fight for you. If not, if not, the way the way is happening here right now, they will deport you. They are doing massive deportation right now. They don't care right now whether families or no families, they are doing it. Thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe, like, share, and comment. I will still bring you guys if there is a new, a new update. I will come and update you guys. Bye. See you all in my next video. Bye bye.